Uh, hello everyone, it's Sheila back again. Um, I've just finished knitting all um, the pieces for um, this little cardigan. It's uh, to fit a 26 inch for a, um, a seven year old. It's from a, my seven year old great granddaughter. Um, and I'm going to show how I pick up the stitches for, for this. Now, I always do the neck pick up the stitches for the neck I always do the um the neck before I sew it up or I sew it up after I put the um the neck on that's my way of doing things and I'm going to do this I'll start off with the um with the right front and pick up the stitches do the long end I go right through the double, the double cast off stitches on the um, the front. So that's two. It's three. It's four. Five. Six seven eight So they have picked up two, four, six, eight, ten, twelve, fourteen, sixteen stitches. So I've took sixteen stitches on the right front. So when I come to the left front, I'll want sixteen on there. But before that, I have to knit the next seven stitches off the top of the um the sleeve and i always do um the first row picking the stitches up i i just knit knit all the stitches and then do the um the rib afterwards That's all stitches for the sleeve. And now I've got the stitches for the for the back. Only the needle's facing the wrong way, so I'm gonna to have to take the stitches off the needle off the um the holder. Put it onto uh, onto mother knitting needle. That's the stitches for the back picked up and I'm using a, a three and a quarter millimetre needle. I did the um the knitting in four millimetre, but I'm doing the neck the same as what I've done the um the ribs on. And I have to pick up all the stitches from the um the back now.
not to stitch just from the the back picked up and the stitches for the the sleeve I have to put them onto the um, the needle again because they're I've dropped a one. I have to pick that up with. Now yeah, now I'm going to knit the the stitches from the the sleeve. The second sleeve. Now I have to pick up the stitches from the um, the left front and I want 16 stitches to match the right front. So pick one, two, that's three. Four, five, six, That's sixteen. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen. And that's all the stitches picked up for the um the neck. And now I'm going to rib a few rows, probably about eight rows, and then I'll show you um after that. So that's 75 stitches and I've knit the first rib row and I'm going to slip the first stitch at the second third, and just do twisted rib the same as what I've done on the um, the sleeves and the, the back and fronts. Probably for about eight rows. That's all it is is to picking up the stitches for the um the neck and putting the the rib neck band on. And I'll do a few more rows and then I'll come back and show um, how to cast these stitches off. I'll have knit um, six rows in twisted rib and now I'm going to cast these stitches um, up. And when I cast them off, I cast them off the same way that I knit them in the twisted rib. Which is knitting into the back of the, um, the knit stitch. So I'm going to slip the first stitch. Knit into the back, that's how I do the twisted rib into the, the back of the knit stitch. And take that first stitch over. Slip the purl stitch, take that stitch over. And don't pull the stitches tight when you're doing this because you don't want to tight cast off. You want to stretch for... And that's all you do all the way along the row. Just knit and 
take the sec the first stitch over the second stitch every time. And now I'll meet you at the end when I get to the last few stitches. And you don't need to stitch the stitches as slack as um, when you cast them off for a, um, a sweater because you're not, this is a cardigan, you're not pulling it over the, um, the head. So it doesn't need to be quite as slack as what you would do if you were doing a, um, a sweater. And I'm on to the last few stitches here. And that's my last stitch cast off. And I'll snip the, the wool here. And that's a nice neck with a little bit stretch in it. Uh, you need that little bit stretch in it, um, even in a cardigan, because uh, when a child has it fastened right up to the neck, you don't you don't want it tight and choking them. <laughs> so that's the the neck on, and all I have to do now is stitch stitch this up, and I will do another video and show how I stitch the um, the raglins here. And then how I do the um the button bands and put the um the button bands on. But that's um that's for another video. So if you like this video, give it a thumbs up and subscribe, and I'll let you see the rest when I get it done.